The Boston Red Sox and New York Mets are both fighting for potential wild card spots. We'll break down their game on a Labor Day Monday with a money making opportunity on a plus money player prop. Hi, I'm Steve Seagrave from SportsMemo.com. If you guys enjoy the content and you know what to do, hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the Wager Talk channel and let us know who you got tonight. Whether it be a side, a total, a player prop, I'll be checking those comments, responding back to you guys throughout the night. So the Philadelphia Phillies fell short for us on our on their team total on our Saturday video. Good news is clients had the Philly money line, and we are 5-0 in the MLB this weekend. Going to look to make it 6-0 today with a 4% best bet. But we are here for Red Sox at Mets. First pitch, 7-10 p.m. Eastern from City Field. Basically, game's basically a pick 'em. Got the Mets at negative 120, Red Sox plus 100. Got the total sitting at 8. Two righties going toe to toe. Luis Severino for the Mets. He's 9 and 6 on the year with a 3.96 ERA. Uh, he's not coming off his best start of the season. Tough competition though. In Arizona, it's a tough place to pitch. Nowadays, he only lasted 4 and 2 thirds. He allowed 4 earned runs in that one. But he's been much better at home, much better. 313 uh, home ERA compared to a 482. It goes all the way up to 482 on the road. On the other side of things, we've got Brian Bayo pitching for my Red Sox. 12 and 6 on the year, 466 ERA, and he is coming off. I mean, it's his best start of his career. Eight shutout, eight shutout innings at home against Toronto, and he does pitch a little bit better on the road. His ERA is a half run lower. When he pitches away from Fenway. Guys, I gotta tell you about a great exclusive offer that I'm running only on my sports memo page right now. You get the rest of the MLB season right through the World Series, and we're gonna give you 30 days of football, NFL and college for that matter, for free. $239 right now gets you two months of MLB and a month of football. It's a great exclusive offer. Like I said, it's only on my page. We are number one in the MLB over the last 75 days. And as always, there's a link to my sports memo page on the pinned comment. I'd encourage you guys to check that out and check out today's uh, 4% best bet as well. But back to this game, I lean Boston. However, I, Abeo, the Red Sox, he's been great recently. The Red Sox have won uh, nine of his last 11 starts. However, I just, man, I can't back this Red Sox bullpen. Not like the Mets is that like leagues better. But this Red Sox bullpen, it's just a mess. I can't back him right now. So we're going to look at a player prop focusing on Luis Severino. Under 17.5 outs recorded at plus 115 over at DK. Now he's fallen short of this in six of his last seven starts. And in those six starts, he hasn't made it past the fifth inning. He's maxed out at 15 outs. And this number is set at 17.5. The one start he went over... Uh, was two outings ago at home against the Marlins. He pitched a complete game shutout. And it seems like when he pitches those like 100 pitch outings, he pitched 100 even last time out. It seems like he's kind of limited in the next start after that. I don't think this offensive funk that Boston is is sustainable. I think they're getting ready to snap out of it. And I think he might be the guy to do it against. Also, the Mets pen is very well rested. Um, all the, they're, and they're fighting for this wild card spot. If he has any signs of trouble, I think they go to the pen. He gets the quick hook. I don't think he pitches the six full innings here. Six full innings under 17 and a half outs recorded. And we get plus money to boot. That'll be my official play for the video. Like I said, guys, my action is always linked in the pinned comment. I always have free plays posted on Sports Memo as well as on X or X or Twitter, whichever one you want to call it, at stevesbook22. Good luck to guy today, guys. Enjoy the day. And on the way out, hit that like button for me. Good luck, and I'll see you tomorrow.